Hello everybody. Welcome to another episode of Sail Aurea. Let me show you what I've been up to. Well, if you want to see my ugly mugs, let me flip it around. Alright. I filled the old seacock holes. All the holes, both sides. Now I'm working on making these. They're for the stanchions. Let's go up top side and I'll show you what we're up to. Right here. We've drilled all the stanchions out. The old mucky, gucky plastic. Now we're putting new ones in. Now also what we're up to is I've also fared the top. And I've cut out the size for the butterfly hatch. Oh, I had a little loss there for a second. All fared, ready for one layer of six ounce glass. Well, sanding then a layer of six ounce glass. But what I want to do first is uh, frame out that butterfly hatch and also frame out, put these frames, put these frames on for those hatches. Then at that point we can put the six ounce glass over everything. So originally I wanted it to happen this weekend. I've sanded the whole top, weighted it down with acetone. Like I said, then I uh, then I fared everything. But uh, yeah, it's the final step for me. For the cabin top <coughs> it's probably going to use about 10 gallons of uh west system resins um other than that everything i think it turned out well uh i haven't had any problems with anything it's it is solid as can be i don't think you could ask for any better and it was quite inexpensive compared to the other expensive foams. So, I'm happy. Anyway, there's a short little update just to show everybody what we're doing here. Again, there's the top. And uh, let me just take you down inside while I got you here. Down into the belly of Aurea. I don't know when the last time it was in here, but here we go. And like you see, I can now stand up straight through. As you can see, put it up to the height here, and uh, then we can walk all the way forward. Just my temporary floor cracking. But uh, there's my progress. Everybody have a good one. See ya. 